Hey folks, today I'll be walking you through how to build a one page website in Notion. Uh, simple that Ink turns Notion pages pages into a full blown website. No code, beautiful, fast, free, etc. This works best. I mean, simple that Ink was built for something like this. Uh, you might need a simple website in, in the sense of what's under the hood. No need for WordPress, something Wix, Squarespace, blah, 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 something complicated that might break, might be clumsy or difficult to walk through. Uh, if you're using Notion, you already know how that looks and how it works. And we take a Notion page and we make an exactly the same, uh, exactly the same visually uh, website. So um, this works best to add all your content on a one pager. Of course, you could do more than one page. So when you want that, we're ready for that. But if you need just a simple one page, this is for you. Um, without any further ado, let me jump into it. So we'll start with step zero, which is optional. If you already have your Notion page ready, skip step zero, just jump to step one. Use the timestamps below. If you don't have a page, no worries, we'll be able to help. So just go to this page, I'll link in the description of the video and just scroll down or click templates right here. Uh, scroll down until you see one page website templates. We're putting together a couple of free templates for you and we'll keep adding those and we'll keep adding more and more templates. Of course, we have more than just one page templates. We, um, I'll let you explore through those, but that's outside the purpose of this video. Um, I'll just take a run, I'll take, let's say this one, I'll take a template and this is what you do a step zero. You want to look for this button in the upper right corner, duplicate, see this, click it. Um, I'll just put it in this workspace of mine and, oh, well, that was fast. Um, let Notion do its thing. It might take a few seconds to copy all this stuff, but this is it. This is now my page. So, uh, that was step zero. Now for step one. Uh, what you want to do is look in the same place, upper right corner. Notion made it simple, didn't they? Well, not quite Not quite as we'll see in a second. Click the share button and by default, share to web is off. You want to turn that on and click copy. Get this link, not something else, just this link, not any other link. Get back and anywhere you see this paste your Notion link here. So in the upper right corner or in here or at the top of the page, paste it. Click, try creating a website, and boom, you're halfway into it. I have to mention, if this all sounds complicated, you can also get our Chrome extension. I'll link it below. Um, once you get it, you'll be able to click right here, and you click turn this Notion page into a website, and boom. With only two clicks now, no more this and that, with only two clicks, you're already in the same place. Um, but let's see, you'll get here regardless. So where will your website be? One pager four ch daniel one two three i'm doing this so i can keep the beautiful dot simple dot ink subdomains for you guys i don't want to get i mean one pager that simple dot ink maybe maybe you want that so i'll let you get it maybe you want to get your name if it's still available i highly suggest you start trying us it's free so it costs you nothing to get this for the time being at least it's free um just get your free simple things subdomain and uh, if you lock it in now will be nice in the long term but anyway a free dot simple ink subdomain get it today it's beautiful it's short but once you select that click here let's launch it big blue button um you'll be asked to save your progress now give me one second as i log in myself all right logged in click the button and boom in a couple of seconds we're already done so let me open this and as you can see your website is live here now it only takes a couple of seconds uh instantly i would say to get everything done here so um let's see scrolling everything is exactly the same one to one with the very page we have here now here's the beautiful part if i make a few changes they are instantly reflected in the website now, because we have a cache system that allows the website to load that fast, you might have to yeah refresh three times. But if I would have done the exact same thing on a separate device, you would see that it is instant. Um, so any change you make to your one pager at any given point is copied over, is synced, as we like to call it. Um, this is it. This is where the guide finishes. Let me see what else I should be showing you. 
I should tell you about this. Go to site customization. Domain here. Subdomain. Or if you own a domain such as, um, let's see, chdavid.com. David is my co-founder and also brother, as a matter of fact. David is my co-founder. This website has been built with simple.inc. As you can see, chdavid.com. This is a custom web, a custom uh, domain. If you want to add one, we have this as a paid feature. But um, if you're not looking to spend at this very moment, just stick to a free simple.inc subdomain. We've got a generous freemium plan, so nothing's lost there. Um, site settings, of course, I can change the title of the site description. This is highly relevant in Google or in other search engines when you're being searched or when you start ranking there. And by the way, nothing stops you from being able to rank in the top positions in, uh, in Google. Our websites are SEO ready. So we already have people, have customers that are ranking in number one positions. Nothing stops you there. Um, Favicon, you can add a Favicon just like David here has the earth. Whoops. What did I do? Just how David here has the earth emoji. If I manage to get this into frame. Yes, I do. Thank God. And um, yeah, previews for social media. I'll let you explore these sort of things. You can add custom code if you want. You don't have to. This is more for power users. But regardless, those are the main things you should keep in mind when looking at your one pager. This is how to build a uh, one page website in Notion with no coding required. We give a quick rundown, a recap of most of the stuff that I've discussed here in this video over here, especially a recap of how to do it in three simple steps. Um, I highly suggest starting with one of our templates if you're starting from ground zero. And as always, keep an eye out for our new, sorry, future new guides. Um, I'll let you explore the templates, especially since we've organized them nicely on categories here. Maybe you want to do something else. Look, well, I've loved the website uh, template. And um, yeah, make sure you have a look at our integrations as well. So once you finish your one pager, if you go to this very page I've gotten to, um, or simple.ink slash notion dash integrations, you will see all the power ups you can add to your notion website. So analytics is one, but of course there's way more to be added. Payments, maybe live chat, a membership system, probably not for a one pager, but, um, you know, translations, this is fairly easy because with, with a one pager, you won't have that much content. So having your website made available in different languages should help. Yeah, let's see what else. Anything you see here, you might want to add. We just have for each and every one of them, we have a guide uh, step by step with pictures of how to integrate, how to add all these power ups, which uh, as the name suggests, power ups will make your website more powerful. But that's it. Uh, let me know in the comments below what else you want us to clarify, what other templates you might want. And um, I'll see you in the next video.